What is up, guys? WK Randy's here, and I'm here with XADK. And we are doing commentary for the 1v1 Multimedia about the, the pros and cons of 1v1 pretty much spawn killing, uh, sniping community, and the, ac the aspects of 1v1 Multimedia's pros and cons, and then other random stuff that we come up with. So uh, here's Alex with some things. Okay. Skyler, what is your opinion on spawn killing 1v1s versus radar always on, no spawn killing 1v1s? Okay, so when radar is always on and no spawn killing, that ends up, even though the radar is always on, of people just like dragging everything out and camping behind everything, which I don't like. But when the radar is off and you can spawn kill, it's hard to even move because the uh, second you spawn, you're pretty much raped. Uh, I mean, players like M forty eight three Supremacy is the number one one v one or with radar on. But I bet some people think that radar always on takes more skill, cause you like know where each other are and you have to outsmart each other. But I personally despise radar always on. It's like taking away the element of surprise, which is the best way to kill somebody. But yeah, wow, this is a long commentary. <laughs> Oh, man. But, yeah, Xbox is the number one spawn killer in NA, and no one really likes Xbox. Sorry, Xbox. <laughs> um, yeah. The sniping community. What do you think has become of the sniping community, Skyler? Sniping community. Well, if you go back in time, yes, we're going to go do a little hot tub time machine thing right now. Um, if you go back and you watch, like, the f very f beginning of sniping when, uh, like Zergriz or Hutch or whoever, Dazzles. yeah, all on Dazzles and uh, making their videos. I mean, I guess that that has inspired a lot of people, but uh, the sniping community is probably at its highest right now because uh, everyone, like, for Christmas is asking for, like, Dazzles, PVRs, Xboxes, just so they can record and put it on YouTube, which is cool with me, but... Uh, yeah, so I think the sniping community is going up a whole bunch. Also, like, the competitive sniping is way up there right now. Uh, a lot of teams are starting. The pro sim is up and running, which is pretty cool. And uh, all the 1v1ing and stuff, it's it's pretty outrageous right now. I completely disagree with Skyler. I think that the, it did start with Zergurus and all them with Dazzles and stuff. Zavaya, IH... And all, I mean, IV, shit, my bad. But um, I think the sniping community... Shut up, there's no collateral. I think the sniping community has gone to a low now. Because of Black Ops and sniping, you literally like, can't quickscope at all. It was all great in the beginning of sniping when there was no Vivo. You could use copyrighted songs all you want. No one really watched, like... No one really, like, cared about... Ooh, Sorry. No one really cared about if like you had great editing or whatnot. It was just how good you were with the shots. Now everyone's about, hey, your editing sucks. Your montage sucks. I'm gonna be a troll and dislike. But yeah, I think sniping community has gotten to an all-time low now. Competitive sniping has been dying out. Competitive sniping has been dying out since Modern Warfare 2. That's where competitive sniping should stay, not on Black Ops. COD 4 it can be there because COD 4 is the greatest Call of Duty ever made. I got him to say that. Okay, now, Sky, what do you think the aspects of 1v1's multimedia's pros and cons are? <laughs> Alright, well, you down some <laughs> kid that can't speak. Uh, <laughs> um, pros and cons of 1v1 multimedia. Um, pros of 1v1 multimedia is, uh, I mean, it gets you views. Um, it gets your name out there. <laughs> there you go. Get your name out there. Uh... It gets people to like you or hate you. If you suck, they're going to hate you. Uh, Xbox. <coughs> <laughs> and, um, yeah, so pretty much that. And the cons of it is, uh, I mean, if you don't know you're getting recorded and you get put up there, people will troll on you. Happened to me one time. <laughs> Sucks. But, uh, yeah, those are some pros and cons. I think it's a great channel. I made the background. That's why it's extra sexy. <laughs> And I'm at the intro. That's why it's extra sexy. But I think it's a very, it's a very, um, what's it called? 
respectable channel because yeah basically it's putting up your 1v1s people don't people say 1v1s don't like collateral people don't say 1v1s prove anything but 1v1s multimedia's motto is 1v1s prove everything because they kind of do because you have to out yeah if you lose you clearly are a faggot so <laughs> You had to outsmart that guy. Look at Skylar failing with the ACOG. Hey, they don't reach a thousand. But, um... <laughs> and yeah, other stuff. That's, I think, 1v1's a great channel. It's, I made the intro. They're super sexy. It's actually, Simplicity is King made the intro. You know, that's us right here. Why the hell is it so long? It took you so long to get eight kills. <laughs> Anyways, and other stuff on 1v1's. Yes, I do 1v1's. Skylar, do you 1v1? No. No, he does not 1v1. I am a sponsored 1v1 or of 1v1 multimedia. My name's in the box over there with all them other 1v1ers. As Skylar says, bitches and hoes. But yes, this gameplay is now hopefully coming to a close quite soon here because we are running out of topics. Yes. yes. I want you to talk. <laughs> is it really? Oh, well, it's pretty much over. There's a few more seconds. You're going to see the nuke go off. So, um, yes, 1v1 Multimedia, badass channel. You should sub and like all their shit. Simplicity is king. If you want intros, backgrounds, logos, blah, 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 message us. And, yeah, spawn killing sucks. 1v1's eh. But, yeah, this is Skyler. And this is Alex. And we will talk to you all later.